This is unit five, week two, question number three. What are the ethnic ghettos and neighborhoods? Why did they develop? They are dense, crowded collections of tenements, poor apartments that new immigrants lived in when they arrived in New York. In the late 1800s, about 1900, 90% of people living in New York were first or generate, second generation Americans. Immigrants are the children of immigrants. They settled into these dense apartment neighborhood complex of neighborhoods where they didn't even need to speak the language of English because they could speak the language of the country where they were from. These tenements became inexpensive places where they were crowded and packed in, but where they could also have some elements of life they'd left at home, certainly access to food and people from where they'd come from, sort of transitional zones where they would live until they were better accommodated in life within the United States. They were filthy, horrible places in health terms, but they served as crowded, poor neighborhoods for newly arrived immigrants. And that's it from some guy in the law print shirt.